Today I'm making a vegan key lime cheesecake and this wonderful recipe is courtesy of Veg News Magazine. Now, if you've watched my podcasts and the show, you know that I'm not a baker and baking gets me very stressed out. So the only recipes I really like to put together that involve desserts and the oven have to be really, really simple. And this qualifies on all counts. So to begin with, I'm going to heat my oven to 350 degrees. While my oven's heating, I'm going to put in a food processor bowl, one package of silken tofu. And you have to use silken tofu for this an eight ounce package of non-dairy cream cheese, half a cup of organic brown sugar, one teaspoon of pure vanilla extract, the fresh squeezed juice of three limes, and then I'm going to need about four teaspoons of fresh lime zest. I'm gonna add three teaspoons to the mixture now and hold back on a teaspoon so I have some to sprinkle on top of the pie when it's finished. Process that for about half a minute. We just want it smooth and creamy, but not too thin. Now that it's smooth, I'm going to add two teaspoons of agar agar flakes. And what that is, is a seaweed derivative that's a vegan gelatin substitute. And this stuff works beautifully. Sprinkle that in and process for about an additional minute. Now that my mixture is finished, I'm going to smooth it into a prepared graham cracker crust. I'm using the prepared crust because, you know, don't like to make the homemade crust, but if you have your own favorite recipe for graham cracker crust, by all means use that. Smooth at the top and pop it in the oven for about 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, I'm gonna turn off the oven and let the cheesecake rest in the oven for an additional 40 minutes. Take that out, put it into the refrigerator to cool completely, then sprinkle it with a little bit of lime zest and some delicious vegan whipped cream topping. My pie is all finished and it looks absolutely beautiful. And remember, if I can do it, you can do it. See you next time.